everyone, it's Sonia from the Shabby Shop. I'm sitting outside here on the steps of my shop on this beautiful day. I wanted to share with you a quick um, project that I'm working on today because this is a project that you guys can do at home and it's just really, really cool. So I purchased a whole bunch of vintage cookbooks at a auction recently, a couple boxes of them. Um, have them for sale in my shop. But amongst the lot, I found a cookbook that had the meat, the actual recipe section was missing and I was left with two book covers. So of course here at the Shabby Shop, we do not throw anything away, right? We always reuse, repurpose, recycle. And so here is what they became. Hopefully you guys can see that. Um, so this is a Betty Crocker cookbook. And how cool was this? I put it in a wooden frame. I painted the frame a color that blended with the cookbook cover itself. And now we have a piece of art. I can totally see this in somebody's vintage loving kitchen. Um, but a lot of times along the way, we have books that mean a lot to us. Maybe there's um, recipe books that are tattered and torn because they belong to a loved one. Um, maybe like myself, I know that I have lots of books um, that I purchased for my son and that were his favorite. So it means a lot when I see them. These are, rather than throw them out or we have no use for children books, books anymore or whatever the case might be, why not frame them and give them a nod to just something that makes you smile. Um, so along the way, if you find a book cover that you love, uh, maybe pages of a book, whatever the case might be, just remember, don't get rid of them. Just put them in a frame, put them on your wall, and then you have this really cool personal art that you've created for yourself. All right, guys, take care. Get your vitamin D today. Bye.